Are you a victim of credit card fraud? Did someone hack your email? Are you getting thousands of spam and phishing emails? Watch this video till the end because I'm going to share you five tools to protect yourself from cyber attacks. Let's first understand how this even happens. Let me tell you something. Companies like this, this and all these are always under radar of hackers. These companies store all of your information such as name, your email address, your phone number, your credit card information and many more. If the company get hacked, hacker also get access to the customer data. Now it's their own choice. They can publish online or they can sell it on dark web. I know, I know that sounds horrible. Let's talk about the solutions. I'll talk about five tools, five important tools to protect yourself from such attacks. So the tool number one is have I been on? Okay. What I can do is to test, just go to the search bar, enter your email address. Um, this is not my email at the gmail.com. I'm not sure if this email even exists, but let's try. Okay. Add on pond. Let's wait. If you see red, okay, which I see that, that means there's something wrong. Okay. This email address has got one data breach found on no paste. Uh, okay. Uh, this seems to be got pawn uh, in a data breach. This is the website where this email address was exposed. Okay. Now, uh, this is very useful. I personally love this. Okay. The, the, there's one more option in this tool. You also have an option of notify me. So in future, if your email address, you feel like or you have a fear that your email address might get uh, uh, compromised in future. So if if that's the case, you can add yourself and notify me and you get an alert or uh, you get an email about this. Okay. This is cool. I love it. Okay. So I highly recommend you try this out. Let's move to the tool number two. So this is tool number two, Firefox monitor. Okay. Again, come here and enter your email address. This is, this is not my email address. You can copy it, check for breaches. And here you go. Now you see there is some difference, okay? Um, in this site, you get around, okay, th that was some other email address, okay? But forget it, no worries, okay? So I have used, this is not my email at the red gmail.com, okay? This is the another random email address I use. And this has got comp exposed in 45 data breaches. It has got 45 data breaches. So this is really cool. You can see Zach's Twitter, uh, India Mart. I think this user belongs to India, India itself. Okay. And um, yeah, so this is cool, uh, but I don't see any option to uh, of notifying yourself. Probably you have to try keeping your account, try doing sign up, and uh, that's where you get some notification and recommendation as well okay so this is this is the tool i haven't personally used it i heard about i heard about this tool on many of the reddit from um, subreddit i would say and i thought to you know give you a demo of it okay let's move to the tool number three so the tool number three it's avast health check now this is very popular i mean the name itself is very popular for the antivirus uh, but as you can see, antivirus, right? Uh, this is a bit different because you won't see the result on the same page. Rather, you will get uh, get an email with all the information. Okay, as as expected, you just have to enter your email address, not my email at gmail.com. Hit on check now, and here you go. Yeah. You can see uh, it says the password have been uh, leaked for this email address. 
So it's sure that this 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 password has been leaked somewhere. It's been exposed somewhere. But to get the detailed report, you have to check your mailbox. Okay. So that's that's a simple one. Okay. Let's move to the tool number four. The tool number four is ThreadCorp. Uh, you can visit this website. I'll, I'll mention that in the description below. Then enter the email address. Okay. Click on check. Bad news. You see all the website where it has been compromised. Yeah. So you can also get the full report on your mailbox. Okay. So that's the that's another one. I have used it once, but I'm I'm still very regular on have I been pawn.com website. Okay. So let's move to the final one, which is on name scan. Okay, so the tool number five is name scan. Okay, you can see on the top. Uh, again, the simple one: enter your email. Sorry, enter the email address. This is not my email. Click on scan. This is good. Okay, you can see um, probably the the result looks very similar to the Firefox monitor. Okay, the second website that I, I we discussed. You can see all the websites, their name information. What you can, what you can do after this? Just visit all those websites, change your password right away. I hope you liked all the all the tests we did on uh, you know all the five websites. I'll mention the link of all this website in the description below. Let me know if you have any question. I would love to hear that. Thank you.